Here, I'm going to show you eight algebraic identities. So, identity one is x plus y, the whole square, equals x square plus y square plus 2xy. Identity 2 is x minus y, the whole square, equals x square plus y square minus 2xy. Identity 3 is x square minus y square equals x plus y into x minus y. The fourth identity is x plus a into x plus b equals x square plus a plus b into x plus a b. The next identity is x plus y plus z the whole square equals x square plus y square plus z square plus 2xy plus 2yz plus 2zx. It's just cyclic here. 2xy and then y and the next alphabet that is z and then z and the next alphabet x. Let us see the next identity. That is x plus y, the whole cube. That is nothing but x cube plus y cube plus 3xy into x plus y. Let us see the next one. That is the seventh identity, which is nothing but x minus y, the whole cube. x cube minus y cube minus 3xy into x minus y. One important thing is we can also write this as x cube minus 3x square y. That is nothing but on multiplying 3xy with x and 3xy with y. So we get x cube minus 3x square y plus 3xy square minus y cube. So similarly, we can go back to the previous one and write this as x cube plus y cube plus 3x square y plus 3xy square. Let us go on to the last one. That is the eighth identity. x cube plus y cube plus z cube minus 3xyz is nothing but x plus y plus z into x square plus y square plus z square minus xy minus yz minus zx. So these are the eight algebraic identities which are important to solve problems.